What's going on guys? Welcome to today's vlog. It is Saturday the 18th of January and I'm starting today's vlog over in the studio. It's going to be a pretty basic and quick vlog today purely because we've got a lot on today and tomorrow we're going to be doing something with the kids at the studio. I don't know yet but we are. The main priority of me being here why it's going to be such a small vlog is because I have been over here today with the guy at the end of the studio. I think his name is John. In fact he is called John. He got these two copy master printers here, these two big boys, these two. He actually got them and fixed them for me today. He swapped out both of the motherboard wires and wired them directly to the motherboard. These are two of the biggest printers that I have in my arsenal. There's a copy master 300 or a 400. If you can hear the cracking in the background, I'm just swapping filaments out. So don't worry, it's, there's nothing major going on in the background. But He's hot wired them directly to the board. So there's no connectors now. What was happening was with that printer when it moved, the connectors were moving and it was coming out of the um, of the motherboard. So it wasn't wasn't ideal and it wasn't productive at all. But as you can see, they are both now printing amazingly well. These two are sorry. This one here is on a nine and a half day print. It is doing Django Fett's backpack and it should be ready in about it says seven days so I'm, I'm looking at around nine because you always add like a day or two on top of it when it's big builds like this because you're always going to get the filament that's going to run out you have to swap the filament out and also as well you also run the, the risk of this has got to be slowed down so that was at 100 percent speed that printer there is printing at 60 percent speed so you need to add like maybe three days on top of it to compensate for that in the corner over there we have the resin printer, the anacubic photon, the FEP tank splitting it. So I've been reading online that um, you can you can get plastic ones, they're made of hard plastic, they've basically used that for, made of fiberglass so they're really sturdy and strong. So I've ordered one of those, those are coming, no that's coming tomorrow. I'm also looking at getting an ultrasonic cleaning machine as well to put the prints in because another thing, at the minute we use isopropyl alcohol which is um, it's a really strong alcohol it's got to be 99% or above to use apparently they're now saying that you don't use that you need to use like household cleaner like flash so I've seen it used with flash and the print quality at the end of it when you clean them is second to none so that's what I'm going to be doing this week I need to get my hair cut as well this week with the boys but there's a lot going on especially like within this business and in this room we're currently printing the Mandalorian armor. We've we've shown you that I think over and over again. I'm just I'm I'm just getting I'm, I'm like a giddy kid at the minute because things in here are starting to look like a productive print room. We're getting prints that are coming out that are high quality. I've shown you this one that that came out. This is the back plate for a set of armor that I'm doing. There's just loads going on at the minute. Sarah is sorting her end of the stuff out at the house today. So it is going to be like a, maybe like a little bit of an update vlog today. We've, we're going to be booking a holiday tomorrow. So we're going to be telling you where we're going and stuff like that nearer the time. We're not going to do it straight away. It spoils the surprise and stuff like that. Thank you to all the new subscribers. Our subscriber count is going through the roof at the minute. We seem to be getting a lot of people. We're getting a lot of people as well messaging us through social media saying, it's so refreshing to see a, a family like you that doesn't hold back, that says it how it is. Instead of pussyfooting around. And you know what, that is so rewarding to hear, and, and for us as well it's refreshing because I think people are getting bored now, especially with the change to YouTube and the way that things are going in general in life and the way that society is moving forward, that uh, there's, there's no point being fake if you're not genuine in front of this camera, there's no point, just pack your stuff up and go, as far as I'm concerned. I also got a little bit of heat as well the other day. But speaking about the um, the Radford family and saying that we have it hard, yeah, um, uh, that wasn't any offence towards the Radford family, but you know me, I say exactly how it is. I'm, I meant in general that we are hard working and at the end of the day, the kids take up a lot of our time as well because we like to give the attention to all the kids um, and, and individually as well because the more kids you have, the harder it becomes for you to individually give your kids that attention. But we always like to give each and every one of the kids individual attention because it stimulates the mind and it also makes them feel like they have got you for that one-on-one -on -one attention and they have got you for that one-on-one -on -one support and everything else 
and we always say yeah, we like the the um, the three musketeers really but like the ten musketeers or the twelve musketeers that we are one we're a, we're a unit and we're in, we're actually enjoying life at the minute life is being good even though we've had this with Aurora things are looking up for us finally so hopefully fingers crossed that that's going to go forward into 2020 so it is a little bit of an update vlog I'm probably going to end it in a minute actually because it's getting on late it is now quarter to seven I've literally been here for most part of the day taking these two printers apart and then um, and then re you know just I, I took the boards out took them down to John John wired them came back had a chat to John said if you need printing we'll print it up for you it's like that in a you know you do a favor for one person they do a favor for you and stuff like that they, they don't like deal in money it's a favor for a favor which you, it's like a community spirit that and I love that it's amazing it's like living in Alaska except it's not as cold because everybody does everything for everybody else but like I say I'm looking forward to the rest of the year I'm certainly looking forward to the next couple of weeks I can't wait to get this armor finished today this Mandalorian armor I'm so looking forward to it because now we've got all the big printers running we could do helmets, we could do like five helmets at once, which is ridiculous. It really is. You can get five massive helmets done in the course of a week, which doesn't seem so, so to a normal person. It's like, well, yeah, whatever. But for us, that is major production. Major, major, major production. So, I am going to end today's vlog. So do not forget to smash the like button, subscribe if you're not already. Make sure you click the notification bell. It does nothing. It's a fact. Make sure you leave us a comment if you can. And we will see you guys tomorrow because we do this every single day.